Five-star offensive lineman Joe Petty. Josh, uh, what was uh, this weekend like? This weekend was great. I mean, uh, shout out to the recruiting staff 100%. They put together a great OV. What really stood out about it so much? What things jumped out at you? Um, they say it around here a lot. The people make the place, and they got special people around here for sure. From the recruiting staff to the coaches to the interns, I mean, they, they got good people around here, and I can tell that for sure. What was, uh, who were some of the players you hung out with? Who was your player host? Uh, I was with Otto and JB. Okay, what were those guys like, and kind of what did they tell you about the program? They're awesome. Uh, Otto's a good dude. Uh, he's funny, kind of similar background growing up. Uh, we're really connected, and uh, JB, he's a good dude. Baseball player, so you know he's funny and just a good guy. Great to be around. What do they tell you just about what it's like to be an offensive lineman within Alex Atkins' room? Uh, he told me he's going to push me. That's for sure. He told me he's going to push me, and he's going to tell me the truth, which are two things I need and I appreciate. You obviously spent a lot of time with Coach Atkins. Uh, what was that like? And getting to know him, I guess, from a personal standpoint in this setting, uh, what, what really stood out about just your conversation with him? I mean, uh, me and Coach Atkins have built a great relationship over the years. He's been recruiting me for a while. And uh, Coach Atkins is definitely a special one. Coach, you can tell that from his guys. You can tell that from his room. You can tell that about the people around him, the reason he's the OC. And uh, he, he's special for sure. You know, he's got a plan. He's, you know, he's a good dude. Yes, sir. You got here. And you went here in the spring for a visit, and then um, you obviously got to see the practice stuff. But uh, what, did, what was kind of different about this, and what he saw something new that surprised you? Or I mean, I feel like every visit and official visit are very different. Like you know, it's those are two different things, and uh, it, it's very different because I mean, in here you get an in-depth dive on the program. You find out about everything, weight room, nutrition, all that stuff. But I mean, when it's like uh, when it's on a regular visit, the practice. And uh, it's much different, you know, you're coming in, you just see base level stuff, can't really get in deep. But I mean, on this OV, I was able to dive deep and really get to understand the Florida State program. What do they look at you? Are you, are you a guard or a tackle for them? Uh, from what I've been told, a tackle, but that could change. Gotcha. And where do they kind of stand for you after this visit? Uh, I mean, Florida State has always been, you know, one of those schools for me. I could see myself going here for sure. And uh, my sister's here, so that helps a lot. And, uh, yes, sir. How much does that help that, that she is going here? I mean, I think it helps a lot, uh, more so than people realize. My uh, sister's been with me throughout the, raw, throughout the whole entire trip, all my recruiting, ever since I've grown up. I mean, we're 18 months apart. I haven't known life without that woman there. So, I mean, yeah. Is she doing some recruiting on you? She is. That's for <laughs> sure. She ain't need to hire her. I mean, she's doing a good job. <laughs> um, when are you looking like you're going to make your decision? Uh, hopefully August, maybe on my birthday, August 12th. You spent some time, I'm sure, with Coach Norvell, uh, met with him. Uh, what, what was, the, I guess, the takeaway from the whole weekend with him and that final meeting? That man has some freaking energy. I mean, we need to bottle it up, shake it up, and <laughs> give it out to people on the street because he's got something going with him, and, you know, he gets people fired up. And I can tell that, you know, the guys are really bought into what he's doing. And that's one thing that I took away for sure, and that the guys care for him and the guys are really trusting and, uh, you know, fluent in his program and want him to lead them. Do you think this is your last visit before you make that decision? Probably, yes, sir. And as you kind of take this next month and, and figure things out, what are you going to be um, factoring in the most to that decision? Um, I'm going to be taking the factor of everything, you know, the program, the education I can get here, the development, the uh, a little bit of everything, to be honest, yes, sir. What did you learn about, you know, what you want to study here um, throughout the weekend? Because I know that's an important factor for yes, you. Yes, sir. Um, well, first of all, I learned that, you know, the business school, it, it's a solid business school. It's not the greatest business school I've ever seen, but the entrepreneurship program is really, you know, what's special and stood out to me, which, I mean, you know, that would always be cool. You know, I've always had a dream of opening my own business and not working for anybody else. So, I mean, you know, that will be great. So you learn more about the entrepreneurship program? Yes, sir, program. 100%. Cool. From a strength and conditioning staff, I know that's big with offensive linemen. Uh, how much time do you spend with Coach Storms and just what did you learn? I mean, I learned a lot. You know, those guys are buying to his program. Uh, that presentation was definitely good for sure. They've got a big staff out there, some big guys, and I can tell that they uh, teach guys to push big weight.